to the channel if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell as well i do drop new content on this channel every single day so with that being said let's get right into this video it is tuesday march 16th and i want to talk about churchill capital ticker symbol cciv currently sitting at 31 dollars and six cents up about eight and a half percent on the day and for very good reason now i did let you guys know about cciv back on january 11th at 13 dollars and 20 cents so obviously, hopefully you guys have made some gains from this video on January 11th till now at $31. Again, this stock was a lot, a lot higher compared to what it, I mean, the price it is now, extremely cheap compared to what it was. So once the CCIV and Lucid Motors merger really got announced and started to gain serious traction, we can see here this stock popped up to clearly past $60 and was sitting at around $60 for a few days it has since completely dipped off as a lot of stocks did towards the end of February heading into March and we are starting to see a little bit of a climb today but I truly truly believe you guys that this price of this stock right now even at $31 is way too cheap right and I'm not the only one who thinks that so Jim Cramer recently talked about it as you can see in this short clip turn the volume up for you guys design model. I think Churchill Ford, the SPAC that's merging with Lucid Motors, is way too cheap versus where it was. And that's what's key. Versus where it was. And it's got plenty of capital to go where it needs to go. However, as I see, Yeah, so pretty much Churchill Capital, way too cheap for what it was. I think the same thing. And it has a lot, a lot of capital to go where it needs to go, similar to what Jim Cramer said. So just to go off a few things, you guys, Lucid Motors is the you know the company that ccib spac merged with and lucid motors obviously if you are familiar with the ev space you know about lucid motors absolutely insane looking cars and i think can definitely has potential to rival tesla now if you see at the projected range around 500 plus miles 1080 horsepower that is a lot of horsepower right so if you take a look at this image here comparing the loose the tesla model s to a lucid air a complete breakdown you can see that the the lucid car pretty much has the model s beat in almost every single category it's pretty interesting and obviously around the same tar price target for both these cars that you know they're entering they are both in the luxury car market so you can see the potential for lucid motors and their cars can definitely rival tesla the former chief of engineer is the head of lucid motors the former chief engineer for tesla is the head of lucid motors so can be very very big and has potential to be very very big player in the ev market so what is really causing this stock to pop up today up around like i said two dollars is that churchill capital well sorry a potential partnership between lucid motors and apple has become the latest subject of speculation for churchill capital corp and its investors all right so there's been a lot of talk over the past couple weeks about lucid motors and apple possibly working together would be absolutely insane for both of these companies i think so to date the most significant connection between apple and lucid motors is that sir joni ive the chief former chief engineer at apple who left the company back in 2019 today mr ive serves as an operating partner for spac churchill capital corp which is slated to merge with lucid motors by quarter two of this year however this is not this connection is on its own it's not enough to produce a potential partnership so let's dig deeper and as you can see here that we believe that apple is unlikely to directly acquire lucid motors at this stage because of the merger with churchill capital and lucid motors is now worth anywhere between 11 and 0.75 billion which is the transaction equity value and 24 billion of the valuation based on churchill capital's pipe investments so apple and ccib are connected because of lucid motors and if this does happen obviously can have a ccib going absolutely crazy also today is big big news because lucid motors the ceo is going to be on mad money today so that is another probably huge reason why the stock is going crazy as well so also today lucid ceo pete ralston is set to discuss the firm's production process progress and the ccib stock merger with the bullish jim kramer on cnbc's mad money later today the often lucid kramer seems to like the merger primarily as a vote for the ev growth while acknowledging concerns about SPACs. so 
the price that CCIV is currently sitting at, you guys, I think is way too cheap for this stock for where it could go and for where it was, right? So definitely right now, if you don't have this already, put this stock on your watch list. You guys, Lucid Motors has massive amounts of potential in the EV market, and a lot of big things are coming up in regards to Lucid Motors and the SPAC. Churchill Capital Corp founder Michael Klein is raising a billion dollars for a new SPAC. So Michael Klein is the CEO of Churchill Capital and the founder, and he's looking to raise one billion for his eighth SPAC company, according to S1 regulatory filings from the SEC. So he's do, he's he's creating another SPAC. So I really like the things Michael Klein does, and I think he's able to build up these SPACs and acquire companies and really grow them cohesively. And I think he's doing that with Churchill Capital and Lucid Motors. So I definitely think you guys need to be watching this uh, interview today. If you are interested in you know investing in CCIV, watch this interview today with Jim Cramer on Mad Money with the CEO of Lucid Motors. It should be great stuff. And I think the information that comes from the interview, we can see have an impact on the share price. So definitely, you guys, make sure you guys have CCIV on your watch list if you don't already. Again, price is cheap right now, even at $30 in my opinion. Hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, drop a like on this video. And as always, you guys have a great day.